Hello everyone and welcome back to Predator's World. Today we have a fascinating topic to explore, the diverse world of hares. These small mammals are often mistaken for rabbits, but they have their own unique characteristics and species. Join me as we dive into the world of hares and discover the various types that exist. Before we delve into the different types, let's start by understanding what hares are. Hares are mammals belonging to the family Leporidae. They are known for their long ears, powerful hind legs, and distinctive behaviors. Unlike rabbits, hares are typically larger in size and have longer ears. There are several species and subspecies of hares around the world, each adapted to different habitats and regions. Some common types of hares include 1. European hare, Lepus europaeus. The European hare, also known as the brown hare, is one of the most widespread hare species in Europe and parts of Asia. It is characterized by its reddish-brown fur and large size. 2. Snowshoe Hare, Lepus Americanus. The snowshoe hare is found in North America, primarily in Canada and the northern United States. It has large hind feet that help it move easily in snowy environments and undergoes seasonal changes in fur color, turning white in winter and brown in summer. 3. Arctic Hare, Lepus Arcticus. Arctic hares inhabit the Arctic regions of North America, Greenland, and Northern Eurasia. They are well adapted to cold climates and have thick white fur to blend in with snowy surroundings. 4. Mountain hare, Lepus timidus. The mountain hare is found in upland areas of Europe and Asia. It is similar in appearance to the European hare, but is typically smaller and adapted to mountainous habitats. 5. Black-tailed jackrabbit, Lepus californicus. The black-tailed jackrabbit is native to North America, particularly the western United States. It is known for its long ears and distinctive black tail. 6. White-tailed jackrabbit, Lepus townsendi. This jackrabbit species is found in western North America and is known for its white tail and large ears. 7. Cape Hare, Lepus capensis. The Cape Hare is native to parts of Africa, including southern Africa. It has gray-brown fur and is adapted to various habitats, including grasslands and semi-desert regions. 8. Indian Hare, Lepus nigricolis. Found in India, Nepal, and neighboring regions, the Indian Hare has a pale gray-brown coat and is typically smaller in size compared to some other hare species. 9. Japanese Hare, Lepus brachyurus. Native to Japan, this hare species is known for its short tail and can be found in various habitats, including forests and grasslands. 10. Manchurian Hare, Lepus manchuricus. Found in northeastern Asia, including parts of China and Russia, the Manchurian Hare has gray-brown fur and is adapted to forested environments. The population states of hare species may include the following categories. 1. Stable population. In some areas where hare habitats are well-preserved and environmental conditions are suitable, hare populations may remain stable. These populations experience relatively consistent numbers over time. 2. Fluctuating populations. Many hare species, such as the snowshoe hare, are known for cyclic population fluctuations. These fluctuations involve rapid increases in population size, followed by sharp declines. These cycles are often linked to food availability and predation, with peak populations occurring when food is abundant and declining when food becomes scarce or predation pressure increases. 3. Declining populations. Hare populations can decline due to various factors, including habitat loss, fragmentation, and climate change. In some regions, hares may face threats from habitat destruction, pollution, or hunting, leading to declining numbers. 4. Endangered or threatened populations. In certain cases, hare species may be classified as endangered or threatened, indicating that their populations are at significant risk of decline or extinction. This can be due to habitat destruction, invasive species, disease, or other factors. 5. Regionally variable populations. Hare populations can vary significantly from one region to another within the species range. Factors such as local climate, habitat quality, and human activities can influence population dynamics in specific areas. 6. Introduced or invasive populations. In some cases, hares have been introduced to new regions where they become invasive species, outcompeting native species and causing ecological imbalances. 
It's important to note that the population status of hare species can change over time due to various ecological, environmental, and human-induced factors. Conservation efforts may be implemented to protect and manage hare populations, especially when they are at risk of decline or face specific threats. Monitoring and research are crucial for understanding and conserving these species.